It's the price hike row over popular pub grub. These days, a schnitty and chips could set you back, wait for it, almost $44. And it has customers spitting chips. We obviously can't double the price just like chicken has. If we do that, then we potentially won't have any customers coming in because it's simply too expensive. Winner, winner, but not this chicken dinner. Would you spend $50 on a chicken schnitzel? No way, that's like my grocery for the week. The humble palmy and chips is a mash made in heaven, but it's now setting customers back more than breadcrumbs and we've all got the schnitz about it. Did you ever think hot chips would be a hot commodity? Never, never. <laughs> Like I said, I've been in the industry a long time. I've never, ever thought that we would never be able to get chips. The price of chicken and potatoes is up. It's bad news for carb lovers, but even worse if you sell wings and fries like Mike. At Wing Boy, we average a tonne of chicken a week. So as you can imagine, if it's doubled in price on, on a tonne of chicken, it's significant to the business and really affects our bottom line. Mike says price is one problem, supply is another. There's some lines like tater tots that we haven't had availability on for nearly six months now. Wing Boy runs through 20 to 30 cartons of fries a week and desperate times call for desperate measures. So you're actually having to ration potatoes? Pretty much. And it's really played a big, big impact into our business to a point where we have had to buy a couple of chest freezers just so we can, when there is supply, we stock up on chips. This is completely full of chips and it, like I said, this is just one of our freezers. So you shouldn't run out for how long will this last you? This isn't even a, a week's worth of stock that we have here. What have you got there? Uh, chips and gravy roll. It's just gravy, chips on a buttered bun. And uh, how much did you pay? Five bucks. Used to be 250. Prices are cooked. Our chicken sizzle is $28.90. It is served with baked vegetables. You don't make friends with salad unless you're on a budget. Chips have tripled in price. Um, so at some stage, um, you know, costs have to be passed on. If you order the schnitzel with a side of fries, you'll pay $43.80 at the Five Dock Bowling Club in Sydney's Inner West. Add a beer and you'll fork out more than $50. Owner Pierre says you get what you pay for. Some people are pretty upset about how much you're charging for a chicken schnitzel. Can you understand that? People that will frequent this, this, this place will, um, will understand the quality and the, um, the type of food that we're putting out there and I think we'll appreciate the, the final product in the end. For us, you know, pensioners, it is really lots, you know. How much yeah. money do you think you're saving by not buying chicken and chips? i will be oh, 20, 30 bucks a week at minimum, not buying any chicken. The Australian Chicken Meat Federation is blaming high input costs, like feed, energy, packaging, freight and a lack of workforce availability. Some companies are claiming that feed costs are rising by close to 30% year on year. Yeah, I've been a butcher for 25 years and I've never seen chicken at this price. Adam Stratton of Tender Gourmet Butchery is feeling salty. We're taking a hit with electricity, we're taking a hit with uh, all different meat prices going up. Now chicken was always, you know, a cheap protein to have. You know, for us, when we're ordering like, um, you know, 200 kilos of breast fillet today, sometimes we're lucky to get 100. Despite the year-on-year -year increases in the overall number of chickens produced, the market will continue to be affected by supply and demand factors, meaning we'll see more short-term supply issues and price increases. You never pay more than $20 here at the Lord Raglan and $15 on a Monday. Christian from the Lord Raglan in Sydney South says despite the pressure, his palmy will stay the same price. We do think about our locals and our regular customers and we try to keep them happy, keep it fair and, and keep them coming back.